Peter, I want to talk to you about this afternoon's client meeting because there's something very particular I want to make sure that you know about. Yeah, the I know. We got to get the food there on time this time, Joanne. Yes, we have to get the food on time, but so that's not it. it this is a culturally different group than what we're used to. Well, we can't order Chinese food. No, it's not the Chinese food. It's that this group manages Q and A differently. I just want to make sure that Chinese food is better than it was last time. It's not the food. It's so the Q and A. Both times, I can't believe. Peter, it's the way they manage Q&A. Q&A is not a problem for me, Joanne. I'm really fine with Q&A. It's where I shine. It's not you. It's them. How's they my don't. Tie? It, the tie's fine. Okay, good. Don't worry about the Q&A. It'll be fine. I'll see you later. Peter, you're not listening to me. Ignore distractions and focus. First, don't interrupt. Second, make good eye contact. And third, paraphrase for understanding. Peter, I want to talk to you about this afternoon's client meeting because there's something very particular. I want to make sure you know about this group. Or what is it? Well, they're a Japanese group. They don't interact during Q&A in the same way. So what does it mean for me? Well, it means that you should probably plan to lecture a little bit more and then break into smaller groups. Don't expect the same amount of interaction. Okay, so for Q&A, really don't expect that lecture more because they're not going to say too much. Exactly. Got That's it. it. Okay, see you Good. later. Good, and hey, I like that tie. It's from someone else's dad.